Alrighty, what is going on, guys? It's Adrian from AsianAtomy.com. If you guys use the channel, there's many folk mainly focus on human and animal anatomy, the usual skull thing in the ZBrush and Blender. Alrighty, let's jump into this. What do we have here? We have a tiger model. I'm planning to do right now. I'm gonna break symmetry, press X on your keyboard. So we are planning to do a half model. Uh, essentially, this part will be muscles and the other part will be just a uh, skin layer. Without any really further ado, just jump into this. Uh, press B. How do you use any shortcuts? Press B, D, S, Damian Standard. Alrighty, press S to scale the brush down. Alrighty, I'm just gonna divide these guys in half. I'm just, I'm just drawing roughly. No, no, no. I'll probably leave this section over here. Hey, we got some sort of like so and can come in again and just do it a lot of separation right. don't have to be at the center and again ready you can just do um masking just mask everything at the side I don't know how easy that will be as this model is not symmetrical alrighty but the center is so what I can do snap that with hold on shift alrighty and hold on control command this mask that bad boy Ready and come in. Zoom in if I can. Come on, Adrian. Press S, increase the voice size. I'm just gonna paint with the hold and control your command on your keyboard to paint a mask. In off. Which is not half of this guy out. Ready. Very big so something around the lines. Doesn't have to be too precise there. And also the bottom. And again. Ready. For the control. Sorry for my tablet. It's kind of making a noise here. Yeah. Ready, okay. Just paint these guys in. We'll come back and sharpen this guy out. And hold on. Control and Alt to clean that up. It's at the center. Alrighty. And hold on control. I'm gonna paint over here. Go hold on control and hold and go to mask lasso. Well mask lasso. Which can give you this control. And without control, I'll go back to my pen and I'm just gonna clean this guy up here at the center. And again, come back in, hold on control. Control the nods again. Let's clean that bad boy. Ready. And hold on, quote unquote, and art. Just clear that up. Just looking for places where it kind of touched. Once we have that going on, 
I'm gonna go down to my mall skin tab and I'm gonna sharpen that guy. You can see it's sharpening everything those ages. Ready. You can see the everything seems sharp. Uh, I'm missing some space here. I'm just gonna draw that out. But what I'll do, I'm gonna go down to my. Um, now it's just a matter of coming to places where all that is. Where you really wanna mask it out. What we're gonna do, doing, we're gonna be deflating these areas that are masked. So I'll probably hold up Alt and Control under around the eyes. I wouldn't want that. Maybe Something like that. Okay, sharpen that mask again. Ready. Oh, no, sorry. Yes. Uh, hold on, Alt and Control. Just clearing some of those areas. Spend a bit of time with this mask. Ready. Just creating a cliche. Okay. Cleaning up that bad boy. And then go to sharpen mask again. Doesn't have to be too precise. But you just look into this. Um, okay. Leave that. And hold on control and click to invert these mask areas won't be affected. And I'll go to deformations tab. I'm uh, going to inflate and give it a negative value, negative 20. Don't break it, my boy. Oh, that went well. Oh, what we can do, we can just negative five, give one. Okay, let's say negative five. Doesn't have to be too much and go yeah to polish and just drag this body. Just polish that out to smooth it out. Those wrinkles. Going on. Just give some time, have some order. If it is water, I don't want to break it. Please don't crash, I haven't saved this already. So just give some time to micro polish, or you, we can use uh, the uh, contrast feature. I think that's the fastest. This polish doesn't work well. So just give us some time to load and calculate. Ready. Uh, I, I think my machine is busy running a lot of programs and stuff. Uh, I think Chrome for the most part is, is accumulating everything, taking up everything. Uh, really sorry about that guys to keep you waiting uh, it just trust me once we have smoothed this out cause these this has already the muscles going flowing along it's gonna be easy to not easy but then it's gonna be uh, not that hard to get them to get that echo shade flowing along ready so it's that No, I think if I can cancel this, I will be very happy. 
but I can't. So let's just keep on waiting. Probably just pause, pause the video and continue next. Uh, we'll see. All these um. Okay, it's done finally, and he never done a great job. What's wrong with this guy? Put on shift D to go to the lower subdivision, and I'm gonna use the contrast feature now. Click on the contrast, take me with 20. Look at that, look at how quick that is. But uh, like so, somewhere around these lines. Ready. Let me quickly save this guy before I lose my work. Control S or Command S and save. Saving project in progress. Ready. Okay, we have that. Now we we'll start with the sketching. Go back to the higher subdivision. Level. I'll probably smooth this out a bit also over here. Uh, we'll go to contrast, negative 50. Yep. Somewhere around there. Alrighty. Let me see where I start. Let's start from the front. Whoa. Here, snap that, grab the Damien standard, press S on your keyboard, and do those sketches. Do the muscle insertions. Zoom out, I think I'm losing the muscle flow there. <laughs> Sorry about that. A little bit of inserts. Right over here. This co this is covering the biceps. So I'm just gonna come in. Like so. I like how in, in Zebra you can get a lot of polygons when you're sculpting if you guys use the channel I have been also sharing sculpting uh, in blender and honestly it cannot be compared so far with the ZBrush with just because of the amount of polygons that we can be able to to um, get from here and and also the uh, lagging part. How in um, in Blender it, it like always lags a lot. So again, this principle we starting with the sketching before anything else, which is very important when we doing. Anatomy. So just make sure you spend time with the sketches, which I strongly recommend. Alrighty, let me look at my reference. Sorry about that. Just give me a few seconds. Just load my reference here. Alrighty. Shouldn't be too long. Just want a side view of this guy. Radish. Apparently, I can't find my side view. Give me a few seconds to locate this guy. Shouldn't be too far from here. Okay, the radio ready XO. Okay. Okay. 
can just um, locate and relocating it. Let's just search for it, yeah. Lateral. Hmm, see muscles. I think that's uh, I can't find it. Oh where I placed it. Alright, it's fine. Let me just uh use other reference. Just search for other references there. Yeah. Just just for us to get this those muscles going on first. I mean those sketches. Very very sure. Apparently I have lost it. That I had it. Sorry about that, guys. Keep you waiting. Hope you you find this in your heart to forgive me. I am truly sorry. Alrighty. Okay, I'm doing it, getting a hang of this now. And uh, oh, I got you. Why are you hiding away from me? Alrighty. Yes, this was hiding way far from me guys sorry about that i believe like once we have this side view which is very important and then we will have most the most part of it so let's do the sketching on the side view let's move into side while we're here ready let's start with this just the superficial muscles again. Break your cephalic. Probably increase my brush size a bit. Press S. And then the break your cephalic will be joining over here. So just be careful of that. Some of these muscles, I'm just winging them. The names, I tend to forget them also. I'm not a pro. Just remember some of them. And this these have just a huge muscle on my man. But we uh Alrighty. And could bring it closer. Just give you time with these sketches again. Make it cephalic. And underneath there. Attaching in the scapula. And then we'll get our trapezes. Those were here. Coming right up. But it was scapula. <laughs> Try main three hits. So the last one will come in like so. Come on, my boy. Alrighty. Smooth that in. Okay, coming in this side. Like so. That's the trapeziest. Has three coming to the side, flows that, it flows like that way. We'll go through that once we'll be adding the forms. So don't worry. And then we're going to be adding our deltoid. There's a bit of space going on here, so our deltoid will be here. Some will be here. Just making them bigger. With your doubts. And then I'm just gonna emphasize our terrace major at the back. 
so nice this is so nice just gonna tuck it in there already we have already our Atissimus Dorsey that we just end over here it'll be joining with the, it continues but then it'll be joining with the fascia Emphasizing that, just spend some time with the sketches. These will be like your guidelines. Oh my word! We have a trap sheet. Um, the uh, trapezes, tricep, triceps. Yeah, the tricep trapezes on top. Remember, I always tell you that I also some countries of these names. Okay. Triceps. Try the try. Okay, let's do this. Sorry about that. Yeah, and Carnius will be splitting like that. Brachioradialis. And yeah, we we just having the um, just drawing the extensor and the the flexors. Again, guys, th this is a technique that you'll see on also how you do this in Blender. Um, I first start with sketches, as you guys can see, before I even uh, come in and building in those forms. Sketches help me as guidelines once I know the muscle insertion so forth alrighty that and over here we have our pets can I be sure some water I'm dying here alrighty yeah. let's continue back to Rattus no uh, but to this muscle. Oh my word. I think I ruined it. Undo that. Control Z or Command Z. Yeah, right. It's supposed to be flowing this side. It's not too long, so let's just be careful of that. Put this man, it's just inserting with the. Uh, we're just gonna roughly sketch the external obliques which all oh, right let me just undo that okay the external obliques will be coming in over here Satorius hiding in there. And in our tenth of our shalata, yeah, we yeah. I'm using a bit of resolution and our glutes. It's muscle. Alrighty. 
Okay. And we have what I tell myself. Just following that curvature. Let's bring that in. Already. And just copy that in. So the tensor fascia letter, th there's going to be fascia all over this area, which will flow like this, somewhere like this. But it's just fascia covering all the muscles which will cover until we are. It's very nice to have these. Going on. Gastric nemius with the Hercules tendon. A very nice muscle. Easy to find, as you can see. We're just sending these tenons away oh, yeah, right there. <laughs> Having trouble panning around. Like switching between these softwares, you, you just gotta lose it. Part three. Let's see. Let's see if I'm putting it right. Look at that. Gastric nemus. And I have a new tendon over here. In order to be honest. Going on. Ready. All that to leave out. Probably at the front. This muscle from the ear, which runs through <laughs> the ear. And then the organs. And then this the external muscle here. Yeah. And also we have the vein. Renal artery. A very big one. Which I, I don't want to leave out. Passes through underneath under the masseter muscle, which is a jaw muscle over here, and it just runs down until it splits. Where yeah, just get that out, don't be afraid. And then the masseter. And all these jaw muscles. Oh yeah. Which the line uses. So yeah, that's it for the sketching part. We roughly went through the um the sketches and in the next lecture we'll be building the forms. Alright, thank you guys for that. See you guys for missing out to make a car. See you guys next time.